here from Ligu. This is the Ligu S8 phone, which comes with some very nice specifications. Uh, and you can tell, you know, who they got inspiration from in terms of the name here. Uh, well, does it actually, you know, uh, perform like a real Galaxy S8? I'm going to have a look. Uh, so an IPS display, 5.7 inches, octa-core processor. Uh, very affordable price as well, obviously, uh, from Ligu. And we're just going to have a look at this phone. Uh, so you can see, uh, I think it's uh, coming with a uh, like a full screen here. Well, I'm not 100% sure actually. So I'm just going to have a look but in terms of the build quality. Uh, because obviously, before you know, there was some compromises here, but look at that, that looks fantastic. Uh, something you know that you would expect from Samsung or HTC. So this is the front, uh, which looks pretty good in terms of ratios here. Uh, I will just uh, show you as well what we get in the box. So you can see uh, we are getting a charger, uh, which comes with the two pin here. So you may need uh, an adapter if you come from Europe. Uh, but uh, you can see it's an official kind of legal charger here. Uh, we'll just uh, have a look at this on the box. So I'm guessing this is your earphones. Nice to see. As you can see, very decent pair. Uh, wow, they look really nice actually. You know, where uh, you get the same volume control as well. And also, the main box, uh, which is your SIM tool, and you get uh, a case with this one as well. Uh, so look at these manifest phones, and what's this? This is the charging cable, it's very solid, as you can see. So quite a nice unboxing experience here, you know, definitely putting a lot of thought and attention in it. We'll just have a look at the uh, phone. So you can see it's coming with your dual camera, very nice shiny back here, similar to your Honor phones again. I mean they've really stepped up their build quality here with these phones. Uh, old type charging, a little you know negative there. I would like to see the new type of charging. We'll just keep it on for now and boot it on. Front facing flash. Looks like you get two selfie cameras here. So, Ligu, I do remember a uh, big. Uh, was Ligu's big focus was battery. And you can see this is the actual uh, display, which was pretty awesome. I've got to say, uh, obviously, there's a little bit of bezel at the top, but they've really kind of maximized the proportions here in the uh, bezel uh, at the sides. And the doesn't look like it. Uh, so a little knock there again. So final box. But we'll just go through this. Nice and quick. And next, skip. Anything else? Oh, this is a nice wallpaper. It looks a bit like Samsung here. And it looks like it does have a, like a software and a skin a little bit. Uh, so, this is the maximum brightness. 
again, you know, I would say it could be a little bit brighter. Uh, but then again, I do have it under some very harsh lighting. Ooh, adaptive displays on. So we'll just turn that off uh, to get the true maximum brightness. That's better. Uh, so you can see, very nice and pleasant interface here. Uh, you can see it is a little bit like EMUI, uh, which takes some getting used to. But I'm sure, you know, you can... So, online wallpaper. So yeah, you can see quite a few themes here. It does have to pull them, I guess, off the server. So I'll look at the camera, see what it can do. So we're feeling fruity today. And let's oh, fast focus. There we go. And always use that. There you go. So you can see quite uh, nicely. Uh, I'm guessing we don't probably get 4K video recording. Uh, video quality, fine, so quite an uh, old looking interface, I think they could improve that a little bit, uh, but as long as it gets the job done, that is the main thing. Uh, so yeah, you know, a very nice handset here, uh, which as I said, you know, is very uh, affordable. Uh, I will leave a link in the description if you want to check it out. Uh, the only things I would notice here is that they could improve the display brightness uh, and also this, you know, uh, screen protector, I found it quite difficult to remove, but uh, maybe, you know, I'll have some patience off camera and get it off. Uh, but this has been a quick video of the uh, Lingu S8. If you've got any questions, let me know. Hope you found the video helpful and I'll see you in the next one.